Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review of Your Creative Studio. They've kindly gifted me this stationery box. It's vintage themed. So I just wanted to quickly show you their um, website. So if you go onto their Instagram, which looks like this, <laughs> um, they've actually got some really pretty images um, throughout their Instagram feed. But if you click here onto their website, you can see the price of their box. So the stationary box vintage themed in US dollars is $27.90. If you change it to Australian dollars, it's $41.31. Um, and they've also got lots of um, they've also got lots of other things on their website as well if you wanted to go check them out. So I'm really excited for this one. I actually forgot it was coming. So when it came in the mail, I was actually super excited. Um, I think the packaging is very nice and simple. There's a little note on the front here, which pretty much just says, thank you for subscribing to our vintage themed stationery box. And then there's also um, a little bit about if you can purchase other items, it will be free shipping, the website, the Instagram, and then the lovely lady who sent it to me, her name is Amanda. So thank you so much, Amanda, for sending this to me. I can't actually wait to go inside because I love vintage theme. And I really want to keep this little sticker here. Oh, no, I ripped the paper already. Oh, this is so exciting. Okay, so as you can see, we have a little washi tape here, which is actually really gorgeous. It's got some vintage stamps around it. So I'll show you that one up close in a second. Let me just have a sneak peek first of what's inside. <gasps> There's so much cool stuff in here. Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, and then project, um, what's that? That's really cool. Some papers at the bottom. All right, so I'll pop it all back in the way it came. <gasps> Some pretty stuff there. And pretty stuff there. So I don't know how you guys want me to open this. Maybe I'll just do it one by one. I'll pick them out and we'll do a close up. So we'll start with this one here. It looks like a beautiful stamp. And I love wooden stamps, especially if they're on an actual wooden um, like it looks like it's been cut out of tree. <laughs> I really like that. Let me get that in focus for you guys. So, oh, actually, which way does this sit? Oh, how beautiful is that? It's a mailbox and it's got all these beautiful plants, like vines going up it. I really like that. We'll do a stamp of that one in a second. So I'll pop that one there. Next is another little box. So I really want to keep this packaging. Oh, it's a beautiful wooden stamp as well. And I think that says special gift for you. So let me again do another close up. Very pretty. I'll show a little stamp of this one again at the end. Um, again, I'll open this one up at the end, but if you can see close up, it looks like vintage postal stamps around the edges. Oh, this is beautiful. I think these might be rub on stickers, but they definitely look like stickers. And it actually says your creative studio, so I think she's actually made this, which is amazing. <laughs> wow. Next, we've got little mini envelopes. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Oh my goodness. No, it's not. They're um, writing paper, I think. I don't think you actually fold them up. Actually, I have no idea. Let me try. Do you fold these or do you write on them? Oh, yes, you do fold them up. Oh, cool. I really like this. So let me fold that in. This is such a beautiful box. Okay, so it's got the little from. Oh, sorry, was that in focus? My camera decides to focus in and out, so I do apologize. So it has a little from at the back, the little, oh, the two at the front, the from at the back, and then you open it up, 
and you can write your little message there. I adore that so much. Let's pop that one to the side. Okay, so next we've got this gorgeous um, little envelope here and it's actually using the stickers that she created, I'm guessing. I think that one's this one down here. So I really like that. Oh, I really don't want to break this. Oh no, I'm going to have to rip it. I'm going to open it from this side so I can keep that <laughs> intact. Oh, how cute. It's a little key charm. I might actually clip that at the top of my journal. I like that a lot. It's beautiful. Thank you. So next we have this really fine washi. I don't know a lot of these brands, to be honest with you. Um, but it looks like it's just... Oops. Um, black and white. There's like a little stripe on this side and a little curve on that side. Should be really cute for journaling. I like that. Alright, next. Next. Oh, the paper pads. Oh, how lovely. I really like those ones. I could definitely journal with those. I think I might have to make a little journal. Um, journal with me <laughs> in this video. We'll see how we go. I'll use a lot of them, but I don't know if I'll do a full journal with me. But I really want to see how they all look. Oh, this looks like an envelope. This is cool. <gasps> what is inside? Oh, my goodness. What are these? These are sick. I think these are the, like the, you scratch them, not scratch them. Ah, what's the name of these? They're like transferable stickers where you scratch them onto the paper and they look like they um, are part of the paper. What's the name of that? Let's see if I can read it. No, the writing is in Chinese. Oh, they're gorgeous. I love them so much. And the envelope's cute. I thought it was just an envelope. Like, oh, this is a lovely envelope. <laughs> And I got really excited about the envelope, but inside was even more like magical. So I don't understand this. Do you just put down like the time and date you saw like a movie or read a book? Oh, okay. So it's like a little, I think what you do is let me bring this up so you can see this. So I think what you do is you circle the little picture. So if it's a book you've read, you circled or you write other, you put the date and place the title of whatever it was, you colour in the stars, you write a comment so you can track like your favourite movies or favourite songs or favourite book that you've read. I really do like that idea, that's quite cool. Oh again, I think this is the same as the last one, so it's the same all throughout. So to-do list, important list, so it's just a little planner. Um, for projects it says and then lovely on the bottom are these beautiful papers oh that I can't wait to put in the travel journal these are gorgeous oh I really like that one. <laughs> oh, lovely um, let me show you what the stamps look like up close I'll pop a few of the papers in a journal I'll show you a few of these beautiful stickers here um, and let me know in the comments below if you really like this box, if you want to purchase it yourself, if you want to see more reviews. Um, and let's get on with a little journal with me. Mm -hmm.